My dear respected brothers and elders, mothers and sisters, talking about Masjid al-Aqsa and um, something just comes to the mind and it's regarding the dome colour of Masjid al-Aqsa. Many Muslims, I mean even speaking to many Muslims recently, we do not understand or we do not know that the dome colour of Masjid al-Aqsa is the dark green greyish colour one. We're made to believe that the dome colour of Masjid al-Aqsa is the golden one. And any picture that we see, you know, whenever they, anyone talks about, the media talks about Masjid al-Aqsa, they always put the golden dome in front. This golden dome is the dome of rock. And this is not Masjid al-Aqsa. In the media we're shown the golden dome. On the pictures we're shown the golden dome. Many Muslims were living today that we do not know that the golden dome is not Masjid al-Aqsa. The dark, greyish, greenish dome is Masjid al-Aqsa. It's two different things. Just recently my children were asking me as well is um, which is the Masjid al-Aqsa because the golden dome it sticks out from really really far and it's shown a lot more as Masjid al-Aqsa but it's not Masjid al-Aqsa. There's many reasons that this is shown and shown that this is Masjid al-Aqsa which I don't really want to go into detail with at this moment in time. So my dear respected brothers and elders, mothers and sisters, it's very important for us to understand the fact that the dark green greyish dome is Masjid al-Aqsa's dome. As Muslims, we have a deep connection with Masjid al-Aqsa. After Makkah al-Makarrama and Madinah al-Munawwara, the third most holiest site on earth is Masjid al-Aqsa. It was the second masjid built after Baytullah and the distance or the gap um, in period of time that it was built between Baytullah and Masjid al-Aqsa is 40 years. It is the, like I just said, the second masjid built. It is the direction of Qibla for the Muslims before Baytullah was made the direction of Qibla. Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam has mentioned many, many a times that we should visit Masjid al-Aqsa. The Salah reward in Masjid al-Aqsa I mentioned the other day as well is 500 times. It's multiplied by 500 times. And Masjid al-Aqsa has a deep connection with when Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam traveled um, to the heavens as well as we know as Mi'raj. At this place in Masjid al-Aqsa, Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam led so many prophets in salah as well. And this is the same place that Ibrahim alayhi salatu was salam, Yaqub alayhi salatu was salam, and Ishaq alayhi salatu was salam are resting. And one of the main things that I'd like to say over here is, and finish on over here, is there is not a single inch in Al-Quds. Listen to this carefully, there isn't a single inch in Al-Quds where a prophet has not prayed or an angel has not stood, subhanAllah. So if we haven't been to Masjid Al-Aqsa and we need to go to Masjid Al-Aqsa, take time out and get to Masjid Al-Aqsa and visit these, this holy place and keep this place in your du'as and remember Masjid Al-Aqsa Dome is the dark green greyish one, not the golden one.